Well, it is that time of the year. With the first day of summer, usually means that no matter if you're in elementary school, college, or high school, it is time to graduate. And our favorite high school, Degrassi, is no different as they will be having their finale graduation show tonight where everybody is so excited about. So here to talk about that and maybe spill a few beans, please welcome Justin Monroe and Alicia. Good to see you. Have a seat. Have a seat. Hey, guys, for, for first, yes. and first and foremost, where were you on Sunday, buddy? Oh, um, something happened. That ain't good enough. <laughs> that ain't good enough. Um, did you two have a good night? Had an amazing night. A lot of fun. So I know you yeah. get to see, like, a lot of celebrities and stars all the time, but who are you kind of, like, in awe or maybe a little starstruck around on uh, Sunday at the MMBAs, of course, I'm talking about? For me, it was Psy, man. He just, he's so yeah. swag. Like, you look at his music videos and you look at just him as a person. But when you see him in person, you're just yeah. like... He's larger than life. He, he is, really is. Seriously. I don't know. Anybody for you? Alicia? Um, I, you know, I'm a fan of Taylor Swift. I like her. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She, she, she walks around with such elegance and such grace. Yeah, you know what I mean? she's it's really like, pretty. Are you real? Yeah, you know what I mean. But she's beautiful, yeah. exactly. And I would ask you, but you weren't there, buddy. Selena. We're holding you. You're in the doghouse all for the rest of the day. Selena Gomez. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. There. And I apologize for T-Rex asking you a question about that ring on your finger, and I will oh. not ask that question. Are you engaged? Are you engaged? <laughs> no. Are you engaged? Yeah, right. I'm actually engaged to Luke in real life. Oh, so I'm just joking. okay. We breaking news every day here on New Music Live. <laughs> I'm just joking. So but guys. No. It's it's all coming to an end here. The graduation episode tonight. Can you tell us a little bit about it? I know you're you got to keep the secret until nine o'clock Eastern. But what can we expect from tonight's episode? It's Degrassi, man. Like there's it's just not gonna end happy. Could some may end happy. There's gonna be there's gonna be a lot of. Uh, I, mean, I think it's a lot of relationships because you know yeah. it's the end of the year. People are scared. Some people are graduating. Some people are staying back. You don't know who's doing what, but it's going to be a scared time for everyone. So it's going to be a messy night. Just sounds exactly like my prom. Um, <laughs> so I'm looking forward to it. In fact, we have a clip from tonight's episode, so let's take a look. No. No, 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 no. You said we weren't a fairy tale. I'm here to prove you wrong. <laughs> Who are you? Cliff. Her home date. Who are you? Eli. Her uh, soulmate. Hey, hey, awkward. I don't know what's worse, you know, finding out that your prom date has another date or being stuck in that attire when you find out. <laughs> Only hey. you, Wes and Eli can rock that. I'm hey, I brought that from home, man. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to wear the MMVAs. You said I wouldn't <laughs> You should have. That would have been awesome. You would have been with, like, with the horse and sure. everything. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, come, like, filming this whole scene, like, filming this episode, was it kind of sad? Was it, was the, or, like, the, the atmosphere in the room, was it kind of like a goodbye atmosphere for all your colleagues and such? Um... I remember filming the prom episode or the the prom scenes, and it was a lot of fun. Like we, I remember. Oh, I remember Luke and I were background for like the entire day for like 12 hours. We were dancing with all like the background actors and stuff. So it was a lot of fun. And you know when like you're overtired and you have so much energy. Kind of so loopy, almost we like were loopy lo energy. We were yeah. so loopy, yeah. but no, nobody else was. So we were laughing at everything, and like we thought we were really funny, but no one else thought we were funny. So, <laughs> so you guys are the ones who spiked the punch, basically. That's what we're finding exactly. out. Yeah, yeah exactly. I got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah. Figure it out. Uh, so it was fun, but then the last day that we were filming was was really emotional. Yeah. Yeah. Well, lucky enough, much music was on set, and we got to see a little bit of the behind the scenes footage. So hope you guys want your best behavior. Let's check it out. Welcome back to New Music Live. Our first New Music Live since the MMVAs are joined right now by Monroe, Justin, and Alicia from Degrassi. Of course, the graduation special goes down tonight at 9 o'clock Eastern Time, 6 o'clock Pacific. You already know that you already got a PVR set and you're going to watch it, so I'm looking forward to it as well. However, it's time to open it up to you guys, a little town hall debate for old time's sake. So I'm going to go over to the audience and see what questions they have for their favorite Degrassi stars. What's your name, hon? Hi, my name is Rachel. Hey, Rachel, what's your question? My question is, what can we expect from Degrassi after graduation? 
Mm. Good question. College? Dropouts? Work? Yeah. What are we doing? I don't know. Well, I know my character is, uh, I think, I don't know. We're hopefully post post school, you know, like university. Yeah. You know, that's that'll that'll be that'll come a thing for me anyway. Yeah, I know that Bianca's going to university. Um, but you know, her and Drew aren't officially broken up, like they're still engaged, so maybe she might be coming back for a little bit of season 13, I'm not sure yet. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I think you are she sure. Could make an appearance because, <laughs> okay. you know, he gets out of hand sometimes, so I gotta keep him in line. Keep him in check. Yeah. Keep him in check, exactly. <laughs> yeah, there, you know, there's, I think there's a hint at what Jake's gonna do for the summer, but I don't even really know what he's gonna do. Um, it's really fun to think about it, though. Yeah. Yeah. Just leave it up to chance of what his future may hold. I'm hoping for yeah. Jake, he finds himself, goes to Europe on one of those backpacking trips by himself. Yeah. Kind of like that movie, Rules of Attraction, he just does that one <laughs> yeah. thing, and then at the end of all the grass, you just find out what he's been up to. Yeah, 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 exactly. Like a just a whole Euro trip. Yeah, just... or he's in like India playing the sitar or yeah. something, yeah, just finding himself all bearded He's a out. hermit, he just dropped off the face of the earth. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly, okay, we'll move on to our uh, next audience member. What's your name? Hi, my name is Kayla, hey, and Kayla. Um, my before I ask you all a question, I just like to say something to Monroe. Um, Eli and your character really helped me through a difficult time. Um, during the summer after 2010, I was diagnosed with OCD and I went through a terrible summer and watching Degrassi and your character and Claire, E. Claire was what helped me get through. And so I just like to say thank you. You, you. That's awesome, aw, sweetheart. Um, um, I told this to Aislin before, but you and Aislin pretty much helped save my life along with my family. So thank you so much. And my, and my question for you all is, how do you all feel being part of a show that deals with mental health? That's a good question. Well, for us, I feel like what we're doing is we're tackling issues that people go through in, in high school and then at, at home and that kind of stuff. And that's, that's our goal, to make... Um, a believable perfor performance and that's relatable to you guys and um, I'm, I'm very proud of you for being um, open with yourself and finding that and, and really being secure with who you are because don't let it define you just let it be an amazing part of you um, and that's what we want you to do so whatever's going on in your life know that it's it's not weird and you're not alone there's somebody else there and if our characters can help you with that then that's our goal that's exactly it Degrassi doesn't stray away from the tough issues they, they deal with it head on and that's why people love it exactly um our last question what's your name hi my name is ali hey ali what's your question um this question is from monroe so i recently i, re I recently found out that you did a little singing before and i was uh -oh. wondering if you guys could sing a little for us maybe a little blurred lines everybody get up come on homie <laughs> <laughs> you put him on the spot right there. What you doing to me now? What you... <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I, that, that one thing, I, I did a little thing for charity, and it was uh, one of my friends had cancer, so I, I, I sang a little bit there. But really, these two sing real nice. You should hear what these two sing like. This girl's got a voice like an angel. He sounds like a little bit like a frog, but it's a nice frog. Turns into it's a true. prince, it's and totally it's nice. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Beautiful. Well done, well done. Make some noise once again for our Captain Degrassi. 9 o'clock Eastern, 6 o'clock Pacific, you already know. We asked them what they wanted to hear, and your request was a little Robin Thick. Yeah. Everybody get up a little Blur Lines. We got to dance to this one over here. Over here. Blur Lines for you on NML.